Welcome. In front of me is a POCO M5 and today I'll show you how you can hard reset this device through recovery mode. Now this specific process removes screen locks so if you have a screen lock that you just don't know you can get rid of it this way. But I will mention that even though you can get rid of screen locks you won't be able to get rid of Google accounts by doing so. So if you go into the settings and see that your or I'm gonna just showcase this assuming you can't access your device probably can't navigate here but in here as you can see I am signed into my Google account now this will uh, result in this device being FRP locked after the process is completed meaning I will need to verify either the pin pattern or password throughout the setup process of the phone or I can do so using the Google account that was signed in on this device now for anybody else who maybe not doesn't remember either one so pin pattern password or Google account for whatever ominous reasons I'm gonna actually make a video on how you can just bypass this anyway so it will be in the next video so stay tuned for that if you're interested so now getting started with this specific guide I'm gonna unlock the device and you can see that I do have a pattern set on my home screen or a lock screen in this case and I'll progress from the lock screen as though I don't know my pattern so number one Let's hold the power key, select power off. Once the phone turns off, you want to hold, I believe it's power key and volume up. Though I guess we'll find out if I'm correct in a second. Now when you see Poco logo, let go of the power key. Okay, so volume up was the correct one. Now from here, meaning the recovery mode, you want to select wipe data, which looks like we need to use the volume keys to do this. So press volume down to scroll down. Then confirm wipe data with a power key. Then select again wipe all data. Confirm that. And select confirm. Data wipe successfully. So power key, power key, power key. Now this will now reboot the device and continue the process in the background so it will take the device just a little bit longer to boot back up fully uh, compared to what it would normally take. So just be patient. Now when the process is finished completely we'll be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible on my screen. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your phone however you like. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.